If you're looking for the best marine water heaters, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Whale 6-Gallon Premium Water Heater. We have to admit, we're sold by the name itself already. How can a Whale Premium not be a good unit for your boat, right? This fantastic unit is a 6-gallon capacity of 120V marine water heater with a sturdy double-walled front heat exchanger. We love the double-walled heat exchange system because it uses the boat's engine to heat the water. The water gets heated by the engine's closed cooling system while your boat is running. Its heating process is highly efficient thanks to the, yes, double-walled heat exchange. Don't let the word well throw you off, though. Despite its name, this unit is only 13x19x13. The whale premium needs to be mounted on a horizontal surface. You need to weld the hold down brackets to its inner tank. The whale premium is specifically designed to withstand weather harsh marine conditions. Plus, they are equipped with the latest technology to ensure energy efficiency and long-term use. For these reasons, there are three types of material for this marine water heater that you can choose from. The features and benefits of the Whale Premium Water Heater are, to us, the best in the market. Besides the three materials it's made from, we also like that it has multiple versions to suit any installation needs. You can choose either a combination of electric slash heat exchanger or go with the electric only model. In terms of its size, you can choose between 120V and 240V. The Whale Premium is also top notch when it comes to safety. It is ignition protected and has an integrated pressure relief valve to ensure optimum pressure level. And when you get this unit, it comes with a temperature and pressure drain tube. Furthermore, it's recommended that you get the magnesium anodes to prevent corrosion and extend your unit's life. The number two position is held by Whale 11 Gallon Premium Water Heater. Another Whale Premium unit that is reliable and highly functional is the 11 Gallon Capacity Model. Even though it's slightly larger than the 6 Gallon Model for obvious reasons, you can choose either front or rear heat exchanger with this one. Compared to the 6-gallon model, this unit is more durable and rugged in its construction. It is built to withstand the tossing of seawaters. Plus, this unit also reliably maintains a large supply of water on your boat. Just like the 6-gallon model, this unit also needs to be welded with its hold-down brackets. Because this unit is bigger, the white epoxy casing would make it look more space-saving. Regardless, its material is still tough and corrosion-resistant. Even though you can choose the casing material to suit your taste and preference, note that the tank is made from aluminum. Buyers have indicated that this unit also makes a good replacement for Atwood Marine Water Heater. Moving on to the next at number 3 with QM11 G120V Front Exchanger SS. If the 6-gallon water heater is a little too small for you, but you don't want the oversized 20-gallon unit, the 11-gallon marine water heater should be just the right size for you. Despite its higher capacity than the Whale Premium, this unit only weighs 15 pounds. While this model seems light, its benefits and functions are as reliable as those of other top quality marine water heaters. Not only that, Kiwama has been in the industry for a long time, and their products do stand out. Renowned boat manufacturers such as Boston Whaler and Sea Ray have one of these babies installed on their vessels. There are three main types of Kiwama marine water heaters. You can choose from the side, Mount unit with a front heat exchanger or select one with a front rear heat exchanger. And for any type, you have the option of the 120V or 240V unit. Compared to the Whale Premium's heater, the QMAS is slightly larger in dimension, i.e. It measures 16.25x16.25x23.25. Among the three types we mentioned, we recommend the 11-gallon front heat exchanger model. Plus, the mounting arrangement can either be front or rear, making it versatile to suit your space. The QMS heating element has a big diameter two-loop heat exchanger that provides two different ways to heat your water. This unit is also ignition protected to ensure its circuitry is safe when used on gasoline-powered boats. 
Moreover, to help ensure safe operation, the Kumas has an automatic reset function that limits temperature from going too high. Another great feature of the Kuma unit that we like is its patented temperature control. This feature keeps the potable water on your boat at a safe 104 degrees by controlling the coolant flow in its heat exchanger system. With a safer water temperature, you can avoid the scalding risk while on the boat. This unit is tough as a nail, too, because its casing and tank are made from marine-grade aluminum, so you can be confident that it will weather any condition. The number 4 position is dominated by QM6 G120V Rear Heat Exchange. Despite its name, the heat exchanger actually does both the job of heating and cooling your water. Much like the ones cooling your engine, its generator simply transfers the heat generated elsewhere to the water inside the tank of a marine water heater. Choosing whether to consider a front or rear heat exchanger is a matter of installation, location, and preference. The QM6 gallon water heater with rear heat exchanger is installed as original equipment on many boats. This model allows you to heat water with AC power when docked, or use engine heat when underway. Furthermore, this version has a smaller water capacity, so it's suitable if you have restricted space and slash, or you don't usually have many people on your boat. Its heater features a marine-grade aluminum case and a cladded aluminum tank to protect your unit from harsh marine conditions. Just like the 11 gal model, this unit's 1500W heating element also comes with a big diameter two-loop heat exchanger. Due to its smaller water capacity, we found out that this unit heats water much faster than the 11 gal model. So that's great news if you're in quick need of hot potable water. Since this is a rear heat exchange model, the port is located at the rear of the unit which is located on the opposite side of its potable water input-output ports. We strongly recommend the use of magnesium NO to extend the life of your QMA 6 gal Rear Heat Exchange Unit At the fifth position of our list, we have QMA 6 G120V Side Mount Front Exchanger. A side mount unit is where the installation is on the sides of the unit. This comes in handy if you need to fix a marine water heater in a corner where certain sides are available. In general, its functions and benefits as a water heater system remain the same, like a QMA 6 gallon or 11 gal model. The side mount model is also made from marine grade aluminum and has a cladded aluminum tank. Similarly, its 1500W heating element has a two loop with a big diameter for its heat exchanger, which is on the front. Its plumbing and electrical connections are also on the front side. QMA is a good brand because it is durable and trusted. It is perhaps one of the leading marine water heater brands out there. And in many cases, you could never go wrong with a Kuma unit. A feature that always makes Kuma the preferred brand is how its circuitry is ignition protected. The circuitry needs to be protected because it will not create sparks that could pose a fire risk in an engine room when the unit is safe and contained. The number six position is dominated by Bosch. 7,738,004,996 electric water heater. Although this is a mini tank water heater, it has a number of great features. First and foremost, it's capable of giving off instant hot water as it can maintain the high temperature. It fascinates me because I don't need to wait for even a single minute. The warmth is good enough for my outdoor showers. I also use it when washing dishes. It stands out when it comes to the quantity of hot water. 5 to 7 gallons can be obtained at 98 degrees Fahrenheit. Be aware that it may be too hot at first, and may likely be so for the first gallon. Despite this minor drawback, it can serve two sinks without compromising performance. Also, the recovery rate is fast. With these abilities, I can say that it's perfect for heating water from distant faucets. Since this is tankless, the mounting options are not limited. You may place it on the wall, shelf, or floor. In any way you do it, it will always be easy because of its size. The same reason helps me avoid wasting water as I only get what I need. Just like any other RV Marine Electric tankless water heater, this saves energy as you only heat the water when necessary. Moving on to the next at number 7 with EcoSmart ECO Mini Electric Heater. I read some marine hot water heater reviews which convince me to buy this item. The efficacy of this equipment is not only for household use but onboard as well. Eventually, I wasn't disappointed. I only need to count seconds to have hot water. Moreover, the performance remains incredible even with a distant faucet. When on board, I need hot water to complete menial tasks and quick washing. As such, this heater is a reliable companion. Even my boat B-Day with a sprayer became functional because enough supply of warm water came out of it. 
What's even better is that this mini tent can give you both hot and warm water. I like that it's compact and lightweight with a sleek design and a temperature display. The size of this tank reminds me of a toaster oven. It has pretty good insulation so no energy is wasted. Plug it into a 110 volt outlet and it will start working. The number 8 position is held by Bashi S8Tronic 3000T Water Heater. I like this product very much as it's an effective marine tankless water heater. In just 35 minutes, the entire tank of 7 gallons is filled with hot water. Using it gives me so much ease and convenience. I don't have to turn it on again and again as the water stays hot. Installation is super easy since it's substantially hardwired. I think everyone can do it with no difficulty at all. It can also produce cold water. You may mount it horizontally and vertically, but make sure to prepare enough space for it as it's not exactly mini. Still, you have the freedom to put it on the wall or the floor. I mounted it with PX and once it's done, hot water came out in just 9 seconds. Thus, it's right to say that it heats up quickly. The temperature that it handles ranges from 65 to 145 degrees Fahrenheit. I can customize the temperature of hot water as there's a thermostat swing. Finally, the number 9 position is dominated by Suburban 52,747 water heater. I don't go for a tankless water heater if I want more pressure and very hot water. The things that I'm looking for are provided by a hardy tank like this one. Since I sail for a couple of days, it serves me well in providing hot water that I use for showers and washing dishes. This is also an RV marine water heater as it's mostly used by those who permanently live in RV. I was able to double up my hot water supply from 6 to 12 gallons. This tank can be powered by propane and 120 volts of electricity. Although it's big, I've noticed that it consumes less propane and it's quieter too. Due to the adequate supply of hot water, there's no interruption when taking a shower as long as the power source doesn't cease to work. Before mounting this heater, I flushed it first to ensure that the inside is clean. I did some minor adjustments to the plumbing and it didn't trouble me at all. It doesn't take much time and effort to complete the installation. After the assembly, give the cold tap water 15 minutes to turn hot. That's all for today. We upload product review videos in every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.